A community is divided over a proposal to start a gay straight alliance club at a North Georgia high school. Channel 2's Lauren Davis reports. Yeah, the principal gave me this letter that he sent to students and parents telling them the requirements for a new club. Turns out it's too late in the school year to start one this year, but still has the whole community talking about this issue. Mason Rice and his friend wanted to start a gay straight alliance club at Fannin County High. I feel like it's very important because um, this town really doesn't like, there's a lot of people who don't support gay people, and I feel like if we had a support group to go to, that would might be better for them. The principal issued a letter saying if the clubs are student initiated, have a sponsor, goals, and 10 participants, they can exist. So Mason helped his friends start this petition to see how much interest there was in it. They've garnered more than 2,000 signatures, but they've also gained a lot of negative attention from concerned parents. I don't believe that we should have any sort of any kind of sexual orientation clubs at our school. Some students also disagree with the club. Emily Dill started her own petition on change.org and titled it, Don't Let Homosexuality Be Pushed on Students in Fannin County. It has more than 1,200 signatures, but she tells me she's been bullied because of it. Nobody will talk to me now. Only the few that are my friends that will, but some people have turned against me because of it. Mason says the club was voluntary and just started to bring love and acceptance, but it's done the opposite. I feel like there shouldn't be like any bullying. Like I feel like we should all come together as a community and just accept people for who they are. Even though it's too late to start the new club this year, the students tell me they will try again next year. In Blue Ridge, Lauren Davis, Channel 2 Action News.